Let's talk about anxiety. Why when, when people pass certain age, we get anxious about small things and uh, we cannot tolerate stress as much as we did when we were young. <clears throat> there are two factors involved in this increasing anxiety level. One is the relaxing part of the nervous system called the parasympathetic nervous system. Their function is declining. So when the parasympathetic nervous system is not as strong as before, your digestion is weaker, you tend to get constipation, acid reflux, and your heart rate tend to go up when you are exposed to stress, and your sleep tend to be interrupted. All of this will cause um, weakened digestive system. So your um, relaxing hormone, such as GABA, uh, serotonin, beta endorphin, the production of those hormones also is declining. So in order to uh, reduce the anxiety level, you can try acupuncture, acupressure, meditation, and qigong. All of this um, energy work can help you relax so that you can digest better, you produce more relaxing hormone, you sleep deeper, and also all of these practices can enhance your relaxing part of the nervous system. We just mentioned the parasympathetic nervous system. So today, I'd like to show you some simple acupuncture point. When you keep thinking one thing, get stressed out, and your anxiety level goes up, you can use those points while you are taking deep breathing, either you're sitting up or you're lying down. I personally prefer lie down if you have chance. So the first point is called GV20. So all the channels, the young channels will meet at this point. And it's very easy to reach this point. So you put both hands, the thumb, at the top of your ear, uh, the apex of your ear, the top of your ear, and put two middle finger together, and then underneath this two middle finger is the point where we use that to calm down the nervous system. We use needles to stimulate this point to treat epilepsy, anxiety, prolapse of the uterus. So while you are taking deep breathing, you can press this point and you feel the pressure or soreness and that can make your nervous system restore the balance quickly. So that's the GV20. And the other point is on the heart channel. So um, if you um, find the wrist line on the medial side of the wrist line, there is a bone. And outside, lateral this bone on the wrist line, you can put your thumb here. And this is the heart channel. With your thumb, you press just outside this bone, wrist bone, um, and then you can cover three points. There is heart six, heart seven, and heart five. And all of these three points can reduce your heart rate and make your stomach move faster so you can digest better. Um, and there is also research when they stimulate this heart seven, which right on the wrist line and outside of this wrist bone, uh, it can help your body produce more dopamine. So when people stop smoking or stop drinking, their dopamine level sharply dropped. And we use this point to stabilize the dopamine production. So it won't drop so low that people experience 
uh, very strong withdrawal symptoms. So that's the that's the hard points, three hard points. You can use one thumb to reach. And the other one, very important points uh, we can use to strengthen uh, your relaxing part of the nervous system right way. And we use that to treat nausea, acid reflux, palpitation. Uh, it's even safe for the pregnant woman. So you find your wrist line on the palm side and you locate your three fingers. Line up your ring finger with the wrist line and on the index finger. So the index finger will cross, have a cross line on, the, on your forearm and uh, between the two tendons. So this is the pericardium six. So when you meditate, you press this point and you deep breathing, and usually you can stop thinking. Your stomach move faster, push the foot down. So your acid reflux will be reduced. Your heart rate will be reduced. And you, if you do that more often, whenever you meditate, uh, you can actually change um, the tone of the parasympathetic nervous system and the sympathetic nervous system. And also, if you do that every day for a long time, you can even change the expression of the genes. So if you tend to be anxious, your anxiety level is lowered, then actually your immune function will get stronger and more balanced. That can help us to avoid inflammation and uh, even allergies and a cancer.